welcome back. Today's lesson, we're going to try counting coins. So we're going to take a look at all our coins. See, I have a lot here. And we're going to see, what can I do with these coins? So we're going to take a look at what kind of coins we have, and we're going to count them. So we're in Japan, so we have yen. Let's see, how many yen coins are there? There's one, two, three, four, five, six different kinds of coins. So for our first one, we have the smallest one here. This is a one yen coin. We can see the number one on it. Next, we here. This looks like a donut, doesn't it? This is the five yen coin. So we need five of these to make one of these. So this is the five yen coin. Next, can we see what number is on this coin here? That's the 10 yen coin. So we have one, five, and 10 yen. Next one, we have another one that looks like a donut. What number is on this coin here? We have 50 yen. This is 50. Next, we have this coin here. This is a bigger coin. Can we see what number is on this coin here? This is a 100 yen coin. 100. Wow, now we have this one. This one's very heavy. Can we see what number is on this coin? This is a 500 yen coin. So let's see. We have a 1 yen coin. We have a 5 yen coin, so we need 5 of these to make 1 of these. Next, we have the 10 yen coin, so we need 10 of these to make 1 of these. Do we remember this one? This is the 50 yen coin, so we're going to need 50 of these to make 1 of these. How about this one? We have a hundred yen coin, so we're going to need 100 of these small ones to make one of these. And for our biggest coin, wow, this one's very heavy. We have 500, so we need 500 of these small ones to make one of these big heavy coins. So, we're going to put these back in our wallet. A wallet is where we keep our money. And we're going to see, what can I do with these coins? So let's go take a look at what can I buy with all these coins. Okay, so now that I have my coins, I'm going to be able to buy something from the vending machine. What am I going to pick today? Hmm, I think I want this juice here. So I need to use 130. It's going to be 130 yen. So I need one 100 coin and one, two, three, ten. So let's buy the juice. Now I bought the juice using my coins. We're going to make sure we have our worksheet. You can find that in the description below. And what's the first thing we do when we have a new sheet of paper? We need to write our name. So let's write our name. We're going to count our money to see how much money we have. So we're going to do this example first. So I see one two, three. I have three yen. So on the example, we have three yen. Let's write that on the board. Okay, three yen. Next, we're going to do number one. So I see a 10 yen. So I have 10. Then I see one, two ones. So I have 10, 11, 12. I have 12 yen. But 
Number two, I see 10. And do we remember what this coin is? This is the 100 yen coins. We have 100. So now I have 110. What coin is this here? That's the 5 yen coin. So I have 100, 10, plus 5. I have 115 yen. Last one, this is the big one. So I have a 500 yen coin and I have a 50 yen coin. So now I have 550 yen. Next, we need to count our ones. We have one, two, three, four, five. We have five one coins. So how many do we have in total? We have 555 yen in total. 555. So when we use our coins, we're able to buy what we want. So I bought myself a juice from the vending machine. Let's open it up. So let's get our coins. And what can we buy with our money? Bye-bye. We'll see you next time.